Hi guys, it's Stephanie. It's Saturday, August 13th. I am, I am having an awesome day today. I woke up at 9 a.m. Um, got cleaned up, put on fresh clothes. I got my suspender shorts on. Suspender from so, shorts on. And I went out, I had breakfast. I went out to a decent place. Um, I had scrambled eggs. I had grilled muffins with blueberry syrup and blueberries on them. And then I also ordered a takeout, a nice piece of juicy steaks with, uh, with mushrooms and veggies to eat later. So before I continue on this exciting day uh, update, I want to say thank you to all of my subscribers and to those just visiting my channel for the first time. If you guys find something that resonates with you, then please consider on subscribing to my channel. I appreciate it. When you do, please hit that subscribe button and don't forget to give me a thumbs up and share. We'll be right back with more. I am feeling super energized today, guys. And a couple of videos ago, I did say that I was feeling kind of weak because my iron content is low. I'm not a big red meat eater, okay, guys? And I'm just not. So I'm trying to eat some meat. Now I know for a fact that it's because I lack iron and my deficiency in that from not eating a lot of red meat, I'm suffering the consequences of it. I'll tell you why I know. A couple of days ago, I went out to Wendy's and I bought a big cheeseburger with everything on it. Believe it or not, I think because I ate that cheeseburger, the, the proteins and iron were associated with red meat did kick in it, it did kick in and I feel super I don't feel tired um, I'm not exhausted I have energy and I feel good so today when I went out for breakfast after my breakfast I ordered a takeout to bring home which was I just described to you steak with mushroom sauce and mushrooms and um and veggies so later this evening that's what i'm going to have for supper and maybe some salad i have to include red meat okay in my diet i can't skip it and i have been skipping it i know that when i worked at the yacht club i was eating a lot of red meat and I wasn't as tired and I had plenty of energy to handle a full-time and a part-time job. Yeah. So today I've been working on a small project. And the reason why I'm holding my, my, uh, my camera phone this way is because it keeps slipping over. As I said a couple days ago, I broke my own tripod when I was trying to remove my camera phone out of it. And now I have nothing to hold it up. But I've been looking at tripods and quite frankly, I don't wanna buy another one just like what I had because that's like $50. So 
I went to Lowe's and I also went to Office uh, Depot and I'm looking at tripods, they're in excess of $45 or more, up to $125 and in between. So I came up with this bright idea while I was at the office store to pick up little business card holders, they made of plastic and they're like an A uh, shaped with curve on both sides where you can sit your uh, business cards in. Well, that curvature on both sides, my phone can sit upright right in there and I can fasten it to my dashboard. And that's what I did. And this is what's holding up my phone right now. But when I hit the gas, it flips off of it. So what I'm gonna do is when I have time is put a Velcro patch back there that'll keep it from flipping and that's it. These little business card holders cost me $2.50 a piece. I bought two. One for my desk, where I can use for my phone, and one for my car, which I have right now. Yeah, so I'm feeling good today. Um, I checked the oil in my vehicle. Everything's fine. I added some oil on it. My car's got 282,000 miles, and it's running great. Knock on wood, I, heap, I, I hope it continues to operate this way because I don't want to buy another vehicle at this time. And uh, yeah, it's a beautiful day today. The sky's not perfect. It doesn't have to be. And I'm just in a super mood. And it's mostly because of my energy level and I'm feeling vibrant today. I am. <laughs> so what else has been happening? I'm gonna enjoy these two days off. And I've come to a decision that I am gonna sell my home because markets are high right now for selling. My double Y mobile home right now is worth about $65,000. Um, we purchased it for $15,000. And what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna list it for sale. I have contacted my realtor and he has buyers that want to live in my community, okay? It's a tough time to buy a regular home today because the market has really increased. The good thing about it is gas prices has dropped, okay? I'm driving by Exxon right now and it's $3.59. And I'm gonna stop at my, at, my gas, at my favorite gas station and I'm gonna go ahead and put some gas in my car because quite frankly, I'm below half a tank. And you know me, I don't like driving below half a tank. And it's the same price of gas here, it's just 359. So it's way below, as I said before, it's way below what they were before the price hike. It's gonna be a wonderful day, guys. I'm gonna go punch gas, I'll put some gas in my vehicle and I'll be talking to you guys shortly.
So that's the gas prices, and that's what I got per gallon. Um, I'm happy that it's gone back to where it was and lower. Um, one thing is for sure, when you're in a good mood and you're sending out positive vibes and you're connected to your inner self and self-realization, guess what? When you're happy, you treat people even nicer. Even nicer. Treat everybody nice, but when you're in a great mood, treat them even nicer. Spread the energy. So, I got the gas, um, I got my nice drink, and I'm gonna go pick out a movie to watch tonight and also and also tomorrow night. So that's what my plans are for today. Just chill out. I don't have to cook my meals later on. I already got my nice steak and vegetables waiting for me for later. Um, I might want to pick up some more yogurt um, to have with my, with my steak. I concocted this special dessert recipe. And it consists of this. Fresh strawberries, grapes, uh, yogurt, little banana slices, and whipped cream with um, some dry cereal on top of the whipped cream. I make like a pie out of that in a small cup that I would use to eat my ice cream in. Yeah, so I'm feeling good today. I hope that my last video, I wasn't coming off as being negative. But sometimes, even though I've moved past those issues that I have experienced with people, it's not everybody, okay? It's not everybody. But one thing I'm sure about is this. When it comes to finding relationships that could be intimate, chances are slim. And they are like, I would say only 30% that you might find someone or 25%. So anyways, I'm gonna go down to my favorite area and buy my $1.99 movies and um, I'll be seeing you guys this evening. Okay guys, so I just got home here about half an hour ago and I'm gonna get ready to have my supper, my steak and vegetables um, and a soft drink. And then I'm just gonna get comfy and watch a great movie. Maybe I might go out after the movie if it's not too late but if it is my evening will be indoors it's extremely hot outside it's about 95 degrees guys 95 degrees I got all my errands done I picked up four great movies okay and I bought a jacket a jean jacket for five dollars at Goodwill. Yep. And uh, I played a quick pick today too. I'm feeling kind of lucky. So I played a quick pick in Powerball. Yeah. So I have a very, very simple life, you guys. My channel may not be for everybody, okay? But this is my simple life. This is what I do. I always stay down on the down low, okay? So uh, I'm glad you guys saw me pumping gas today because you see what the gas price is here. That should be national. Right across the country, gas prices have gone down like that. I hope it goes down further. We never know. But anyways, I hope you guys have a great weekend. And I'll be seeing you guys very, very soon.